Yep, there we have it. Operation Blackout continues. Also, as you guys might have noticed in the beginning of the video is that we removed the running boards on each side of the truck and yeah, just those two minor little things makes it look so much better. The only thing that is really chrome now is the rear bumper and the front bumper. And we all know we're getting a new front bumper and we're wrapping the rear bumper. And we're getting new wheels, of course. Those are chrome as well. Which brings me to the topic of today's video. It's not about black door handles. It's not about removing running boards. It is about the new wheels. We are on our way. I'm just about to jump in the truck here and go to Auto Illusions to have the truck dropped off and get fitted with the new wheels, tires, and the lift kit. But full disclosure though, in this video, we won't be able to see the truck with the wheels and lift kit because it's gonna take at least a day and a half to have everything done. But as soon as we get to uh, Auto Illusions, I will of course reveal the new wheels and show them to you guys. But with that being said, the black door handles and the tailgate handle and this little back piece here is by far the best value for the money out of any mod that I've done to this truck right here. 25 bucks, around, it was 20 or 25 bucks on Amazon for this right here. I mean, that's just amazing. It looks so damn good. And what they are is they're covers that you put on the door handle you already have there. So you don't have to do a complete swap out of the whole door handle and locking mechanism and all that stuff. So this attaches with 3M tape. And like I said, 25 bucks. There will be a link in the description for anyone that is interested in purchasing that for your own truck. But enough babbling about that. I'm extremely excited today because I just want to get there and get this process started because this is what we've all been waiting for. Me, including you guys, seeing the new wheels and the lift kit on the truck. That is definitely going to set the whole build off and that is what's truly missing. I've had to wait on the wheels, but they are here. So uh, I feel like I'm talking too much. Cold start. Would you look at that we're back in moon township and i apologize about the lack of a cinematic slow-mo montage driving shots on the way here because i feel like i've done it so many times so it becomes um <laughs> repetitive <laughs> but i just want to cut straight to the chase and in about one minute and 34 seconds we'll be at auto illusions and uh i can show you guys the wheels hello Hey, what's, what's up, up really? All right, so here we are in the shop and let's just get down to business. These are the new wheels for the truck. Boom, we got the fuel stroke wheels. And here they are. I think they look absolutely badass. They are 20 by 12s, negative 44 offsets. Got a thick, thick lip. But here's a minor little issue that we've had. So, so you can see one, two, three, four wheels, of course, no rocket science there, but this wheel right here, look at this. See all that dust on here? See this, this is like glue or some kind of sticker residue or whatever. And right here, the wheel is all scratched up. And it came in this box right here. So if you just look at this box, it looks like it's been around the world a couple times, sent here and there, at least twice. You see it's got a shipping slip right here, or the plastic to hold the shipping slip right there. So yeah, it's uh, it's been around. So it's safe to say that this wheel was some kind of display wheel somewhere because it's all dusty and it's scratched up and that's not okay. So basically, we, we noticed this, I think it was, or they, they noticed it here on, on Thursday, Friday, Thursday or Friday, I can't remember. So they've called the distributor and uh, pretty much forced them to overnight a new wheel that is supposed to come today. So hopefully that comes today, because if it doesn't, uh, I'll be pretty pissed, because I've been waiting for these wheels and I don't want to wait any longer. I have no idea why they would send me a display wheel that's all dusty and uh, scratched up. I mean, that's just, yeah, I don't know how you explain that. That's just bad. 
you know, I'm paying full price. I'm not getting some special deal or anything from Fuel. I don't have any collaboration or anything with them going on. So yeah, I want uh, <laughs> a brand new wheel. So yeah, it's supposed to be on its way. So hopefully it, it's coming today. But either way, here you can see them. What do you guys think? I absolutely love them. Look how wide this wheel is. And look at these boxes, by the way. These boxes, I mean, yeah, they might be a little crooked here and there from shipping and stuff here. But if you compare it with this box, it's like it's been through war. So these wheels are just fine. It's just this one right here that is not fresh out the box, to say the least. But I love them. I think they look absolutely awesome. I mean, it's black. It's got some contrast, as you can see right here. It's not all black, and I wanted that. I love the design of the wheel. I love the width of the wheel. So, um, you know, when it's on the truck with the lift kit and everything, you guys are going to be able to see the full stance. But they're just about to start working on that right now. Won't have time to show that in this video as I explained already, but yeah, this is gonna be awesome. So let me know what you guys think in the comments below. All right, so status update. The correct wheel <laughs> has arrived. So we actually have five wheels here right now, and I'm gonna try to get a deal on that scuffed wheel and have it as a spare. That would be good, because I will be needing a uh, fifth wheel and tire. Speaking of tires, if you don't follow me on Instagram yet, you might not know that these are the tires. These were the first uh, items to come in when it comes to the lift and the wheel and the whole tire setup. They are the Nitto Ridge Grapplers, 33 inch tires. All right, it's time for me to leave. I actually have an Uber coming to pick me up here because I, I, I'm not sticking around the shop all day. And just like that, we are back home. I do apologize to everyone that this video is kind of uh, really back and forth. Uh, no cinematic, nice stuff to look at throughout the video, but that is because I wanted to keep it somewhat short and to the point. Preferably, I wanted to do a full reveal of the truck with the wheels on it, but since it needs to take the time that it needs to take, um, I figured, you know, at least show you guys the wheels and then we'll do a proper reveal when I'm picking the truck up sometime tomorrow um, and we'll get some nice rollers, see what they look like when they're actually on the truck, the full stance with the lift kit and everything. But at least you guys got to see what the wheels look like, the design and the width, the offset and everything like that. So you can kind of keep it in your imagination until we have an actual reveal video with the wheels on the truck. Now another thing that I was hoping was gonna come in today was the front bumper. So I can run it down to Auto Illusions real quick so they could mount the bumper at the same time that they're mounting the new wheels and tires. However, it has not yet come in and it is around six o'clock on Monday. So, you know, I wanna get this video up for you guys and I can't sit and wait around for much longer. Basically what I'm doing is kind of rambling about, you know, time restraints and what I wanted to do for the original video uh, and have everything on. I'm not, I'm not really looking to make a bunch of separate videos. One where you guys see the wheels and then one with the wheels on the truck and then one with the new bumper and stuff like that. I'd rather have the bumper on and the wheels on the truck in one video, but that would mean that I can't upload for a few days when it comes to the F-150. So I'd rather show you guys the actual wheels. I know you've been waiting for it. I've been waiting for it. So I do hope you enjoyed it and that you do like the wheels. Now one person that has not yet seen the wheels is Sydney. So what we're gonna do is actually bring her down here and show her a picture of the wheels and see what she thinks. Sydney! Hi, Lumpy. Hi. So yesterday was actually Sydney's birthday. It was her ninth birthday, so everyone needs to wish Sydney a happy birthday. <laughs> Maybe some birthday fan will do it. Oh, birthday fan, okay. Close the door, Bubba Lab. Before we end this video, make sure you subscribe and give a big thumbs up and then comment <laughs> down below. Yeah, they See know. See you guys next time. No, 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 we're not done. Aw, <laughs> dang it. They know, they know to subscribe and stuff. So close the door, I want to show you something. The wheels on the uh, the truck, the black F-150, close the door. Because you haven't seen them yet, so I want to say, I want to get, I want to get your opinion. All right, so check this out. I'm going to show you a picture, okay? Boom, here it is. What do you think of this, what do you think of this wheel right here? Um. Be honest. It's cool. <laughs> what? It's cool. Why, why do I feel like you're not being truthful? It's do, cool. do you like it? Yeah. Or no? 
uh, no words to Hold describe. On. It's so cool. Stop. All right, so I want to zoom in here. I look, like it. Look at all these cool details. I like the details. Do you like them? Mm-hmm. I mean, seriously. Mm-hmm. So do you like these wheels, or do you like the Raptor wheels, or do you like the Mercedes wheels better? Stink, stink, like. <laughs> stink, stink, like. Okay, so at least you like one set of the wheels. Well, that's good, I guess. <laughs> Give a comment down below which truck you like the best. Do you like the truck that he just showed you with the new wheels, the Raptor, or do you like the Mercedes? But Give a comment down below. The Mercedes is not a truck. Well, I mean, a car, you know what I mean? They know what I mean. <laughs> I think you're a future little YouTuber. When you get older, that is. I'm going to make a YouTube channel when I'm 12 years old. 12 years old? No, not 10. You're too young. 10. You're a little too young. Alright. So maybe when you're 12. Alright. 11. Alright, do you want to do the outro? So make sure you subscribe and give a big thumbs up and we'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace. <laughs> Alright, you guys heard the little woman. We'll see you guys in the next video. So if you're stopping by for the first time and you haven't already and you want to, please subscribe and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.